Hi, welcome to Books with Lexi. In this video, I'm doing my first unboxing for Twisted Retreat. So for the months of May, June, and July, I am a rep for Twisted Retreat. They are sending me boxes and I will be doing some unboxings for you. This is a horror subscription. So there is a special edition of a book and then there are also some different goodies in here. I have not gotten a box before, but I've seen some of their stuff and it is incredible. I cannot wait to open this. If you are interested in signing up, I will have all of the information linked in the description. I do have a discount code for you and that is Lexi. My name does have an E at the end. So the code is L-E-X-I-E just for clarification. So I have my box here. I know that usually there are like, not themed, branded. Normally they have branded boxes, but not everything fit into those boxes this month. So they had to send them in bigger ones. Okay, I'm gonna open it now. I cannot wait to see everything. Starters. <laughs> I wonder if these are the ones that like dissolve in water. Anyway. So they have a card with details about everything in the box, which is great because I'm kind of oblivious sometimes. Bowser, you cannot eat my packing peanut. And um, there's also a June sneak peek, which is fun. So I'll show you that. And then there's also some information on the May box as well. But this little spoiler card was very cute. Okay, so the first thing I see are these crispy blood orange slices. I don't know if these are food or decorations. Okay, it's under food and beverage. Enjoy this unique snack from Dardamans, California. They use a unique drying method that preserves vitamins and flavors. Huh, so I guess it's a food. I'm very interested in that. Okay, the next thing I see is Graveyard Dirt, which is a coffee scrub. I'm gonna open it. It says to dig for a reward buried inside. And this says there are multiple designs. Designs of what? Just gonna... I'm really, I'm really scared to do this. I'm gonna make a mess. No, I can't do this right now. I, I have stuff on my hand. All I did was make a hole and I'm scared I'm gonna get stuff everywhere. So I'm excited to see what that is though. Next is a diamond painting, which is fun. I have never done a diamond painting before but I'm going on vacation next week and it's supposed to rain a lot so maybe I'll take this with me. I don't want to open this because I'm scared I'm gonna get diamonds everywhere but I know that it's a scream like the scream guy you know. <laughs> so I'm really excited about this. This will be fun. Okay I know that they do tarot cards and this is the last one I believe in their set. I don't have any of the other ones but this goes with the candle. Let me find that. Everything is packaged very well. This is so cute. It is for Verity. I have not read Verity. This is the card and the matching candle. I feel like I'm gonna try to smell this and I'm just gonna smell coffee still, but that's okay. Ooh, I like that. This is really cute. This will go on my shelves. Okay, so I've done the art switches, like a craft type thing for the diamond painting. And then I have the health and beauty, which is the candle and the graveyard dirt. And then the food and beverage is the blood orange crisps. So now I have home and garden and lifestyle and then the book. So for home and garden, there's a shower curtain, which is very fun. And this is exclusive to this box, which is really cool. It feels really weird uh, opening a shower curtain right now. I don't know how to do this, but it is American Psycho, which is cool. How do I? <laughs> I feel like, you know how when you like are supposed to put a blanket over a dog and then seeing how long it takes them to get out is a test of how smart they are? I just felt like that was happening to me. Oh, just like use the blanket apparently. Um, and then there is this bag, which is a Nevermore bag. And this is from Nevermore Academy, which is from the Wednesday series and also inspired by Poe. This is an exclusive bag to this box. It's padded very nicely. There's a strap, there's little handles. There's multiple pockets. Some of them have zippers. Seriously, you could put so many things in this. 
so that's very cool i have not yet watched wednesday because are we surprised but it is on my list and then the last thing besides the book is a coin pouch and this is adorable it's a little ghosty and on the back it says the darkness is where i shine and it's engraved or whatever that term is so there's a little pocket and then oh obviously it's a, a little coin pouch but very cute it's too hot for this there that is obviously the logical solution here okay and the last thing the book the book is sallow bend by alan baxter you can see the foiling on the dust jacket so here's what it looks like And there's foiling on the spine as well. And this has sprayed edges, which I think this might be my first book with sprayed edges. So it says the title on the top and the bottom. Oh, there's a creepy girl. Um, and I am pretty sure this is like carnival or amusement park themed. So this looks like this. And then on the inside, very cool kind of marbled Ooh. so both end pages look like that and then there is foiling on the front the spine and the back which is very cool it's hard to not get reflections in it but it looks so good okay let me just read the synopsis to you in case you are interested sallow bend by alan baxter something old and deadly has awoken when two teenagers go missing from the small rural town of Sallow Bend, the residents come together to search for them. Little do they suspect that finding the wayward girls will be the start of their problems. An old evil is rising, and only one man seems to realize that everyone is in danger, and this is not the first time it's happened. With the carnival in town, people want to have a good time, but for many, this will be the worst time of their lives. I am so excited to read a carnival book. Um, This author is... Australian and writes horror, supernatural thrillers, and dark fantasy, which is super cool. So that is everything in my box. I cannot wait to read this. The copy is incredible, and I'm really excited about the items that came in this box as well. I just wanted to give you a better close-up of some of these things. Um, the shower curtain is really hard because it is like a full-size shower curtain. And it's falling okay it's set up a little bit as like a background so here's the blood orange slices the diamond painting you can see the painting a little bit the tarot verity candle and the matching tarot card <laughs> here's the graveyard dirt i completely made a mess you can see there is coffee grounds <laughs> on this because i just shoved my hand in there um to find out what the thing was and it was this enamel pin don't focus on that face focus on this face um so it's half a face and apparently there's like a second one that's half a skull i looked that up online <laughs> The Nevermore bag that I have gotten stuff on already. So this is from Wednesday. And seriously, so many pockets. Even on the back. So this is like a, a very... Oh god. This is a very sturdy, good quality bag. The Ghosty coin pouch that has a pocket and then the, I'm not gonna open it because I have one hand um literally I, there's coffee grounds <laughs> anyway and then I'm just gonna show you the details like it looks so good That's just a close-up of everything so you could see things a little better. What's going on in there?
Do you like it? I'll leave you alone. Okay, enjoy your cave. Just a reminder to check out Twisted Retreat in the description. This box is not available, but I do know every once in a while if they have overstock, they put certain items up for you, and then you can also sign up for a subscription. I believe you also can sign up for a one month box or a subscription and my code Lexi is good for anything in the store. I'd love to know your thoughts on this box if you have any favorite items. If you have gotten a box from Twisted Retreat before, let me know what your favorite item has been. I really like everything but I think this little ghostie has to be my favorite other than the book because we all know I love books and ghosties. I cannot wait to find out what is in this graveyard dirt thing as well. If you end up getting anything from Twisted Retreat, let me know. I'd love to know what you end up getting. If you're looking to find me in other places on the internet, everything is linked in the description, including my bookstagram, my storygraph, and my Patreon. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye!